Hey guys, this is Abhishek from GadgetShoot.com and today we are here at the IFA Berlin 2015 at Motorola booth and we have a new device with us which is called the Motorola Moto X Play which is coming to India very soon yeah, and it is a kind of a variant of Moto X which you might have seen earlier but this one is going to cost you less in terms of the money so this is going to be an affordable Moto X you can say it has slightly different specifications as well it has the kind of design which you might have seen on Moto X but different kind of build quality is there talking about the edges we can see that we have a plastic edge over there which is looking nice it looks like metal but it is not metal but good quality plastic and it is chrome finished over there we have the 3.5 model jack on the top you have the sim card tray and there we have the 21 megapixel camera which is one of the major highlight of this phone so this one has 21 megapixel camera 5.5 inch of high definition display which is good and again it is a full high definition display panel the display quality and the display type is the same which you might have seen on Moto X earlier so it has a curved glass over there which is looking nice and the display is good in terms of the viewing angles again it is not a super AMOLED display but looks good especially on this device in terms of the overall viewing angles and color protection is also nice talking about the front we have got touch pass buttons which are there within the display the loudspeaker is also there we have nice metal ear piece over there and we have the front camera which is a 5 megapixel camera on this phone most probably as per the information which we have we will confirm that later we have the power and sleep key which actually has slight amount of texture to it which is easy to locate and you can easily press it identify in between these two buttons which are very close to each other we have the volume locker which is finished in chrome this is a plastic button and then we have the back panel which is a rubberized texture back panel which looks good and it will give you a very good grip as well and this is going to be available in different colors we have another one over there which is in blue color so this is how you can actually change the look and feel of your Motorola Moto X Play and it is coming to India as well the back panel is removable and I can remove the back panel to show you the phone from the back side on this phone and I think maybe I can do it over there on this one which is slightly loose as far as the back panel is concerned so once you remove the back panel you can see that we have the camera which is 21 megapixel dual true tone LED flash and this is the Motorola dimple part or the logo part again the back panel is removable but the battery is not the battery is sealed inside and you cannot remove the battery on this phone so let me just keep this thing aside for a while and take a look over this one again so again the phone looks good in terms of the build quality and design but it is not that premium especially the edges which you see may look like metal but it is good quality plastic again not a bad job now we have already talked about the build quality and design let's take a look over the UI and this is how the software UI look like the software UI is very smooth and responsive and this has been on other Motorola phones as well like this they actually provide you a very good stock Android experience on their devices which is very nice let's take a look over the settings and find out the version of Android which we have on this device preloaded and we have Android Lollipop 5.1.1 which is the latest version and you can also expect future Android version to be there on this device they will push those updates as per the information which we have got let's take a look over the storage scenario again this device has got slightly less storage this time because this one is 8.89 GB but it is I think divided into two partition no it is not so it is only 8.89 GB the one which we have the one which will be launched in India will have 16 GB of internal storage and you will get 10 to 12 GB available on that device whereas this one has only 4.73 GB available and the application which are there can be uninstalled as well in case you want to uninstall the blockware which is there on this device which is not much let's take a look over the application scenario we have 2 GB of RAM on this device out of that 800 MB or slightly less than 800 MB of RAM is free again the device is responsive and smooth and you will get 1.1 GB of RAM available for free once you take take it out of the box apart from that if we take a look over the display settings I can show you whether we have support for adaptive brightness or not so we have support for adaptive brightness as well so let me test the camera of this device and we will take a photo from the rear camera on this phone and here we have the rear camera opened and again the interface is like the same which you might have seen on the other Motorola phones again you have the tap to capture the photo and when it comes to the front camera I can toggle to the front camera and take a photo in the same way so we have taken the photo from the rear camera as well as from the front camera this is how the quality look like from the front camera which is good in terms of details in terms of color production everything is looking nice even in the slow light and if we take a look over the rear camera sample
sample. Let me take a look over the rear camera sample as well. This one's X plane. Okay. So it's a 5.5. Yeah. Here we have the rear camera sample, and right now there is slight amount yes, of uh, problem over there because of the security thing, because of which mm -hmm. the camera view was blocked. But let's take a look over the area which has been focused properly and it has been captured by the camera properly. So as you can see, everything is looking nice in terms of details, in terms of color production, everything is good. So rear camera is doing a good job. It is a 21 megapixel camera and you can do a lot more with the 21 megapixel camera which we have at the back side. As far as settings are concerned, I would like to find out whether we do have support for HDR mode in the auto uh, automatic orientation. So you can actually have HDR mode auto and let me take a look over the resolution at which you can record video. So you can record video at 1080p as well as at 540p which is a slow motion video let me just come back and show you some more things so this is how the device look like the device has good display wing angles are good build quality is also nice again it is not that top notch which you might have seen on the moto x earlier but it is good it is very much I would say vibrant in terms of the look and feel and especially the back panel which is a rubberized back panel it can be removed and it will give you a very good grip when you hold the phone in hand and this definitely feels like a fresh design this time which they have went for this is all we have as far as the quick hands-on review of the Motorola Moto X Play we will come up with more videos like this do stay tuned for that thanks for watching this video in case you have any questions and queries you can leave your questions and queries in the comment section below you can like this video this video help you by clicking the like button below you can subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos like this by clicking the subscribe button below thanks for watching this video this is Abhishek signing off thank you